everyone, Morgan here. So husband did a thing and uh, he built this uh, nice little solar setup here. And so he's gonna talk about it a little bit. And even though it is a very cloudy day, it's still pulling um, power. So uh, husband's gonna talk a little bit about it. All right, so we received this as a gift from a friend, but husband, how much do you think all of this would cost? Uh, probably a little over a hundred dollars. Yeah, so Ish. the solar panel was yeah the, would sol be. the solar panel these this size solar panel is a twenty five watts around forty bucks. Uh, the controller this particular one some of these something like this is around thirty dollars, and then uh, we got a couple little batteries down here. You can pick those up for probably twenty dollars each. Ish. Cool. Okay, so what? is going on here <laughs> tell us a little bit about it and what it can charge and all this good stuff so basically we have a 25 watt solar panel that uh puts out somewhere between you know depending on the light uh you know 17 volts 17 to 22 volts what is it like doing that. right now since it's cloudy <clears throat> right this second and i'm using my uh multimeter to test it it's doing i think around 16 it was doing 16, but we're kind of blocking it. It's getting a little darker as well. Yeah. So right yeah. this second, we're catching about 12 and a half. That's pretty good. Ish. Um, so, so, mm -hmm. so the solar panel is connected into the charge controller mm -hmm. and the charge controller is also, it's connected to the batteries. So it'll manage charging the batteries. And then from there, we have our two, le two leads to connect power to whatever we need to power. Yeah, within reason, obviously. Yeah, within, yeah. within we can't, reason. We can't be uh, powering a refrigerator or anything to this. No. So yeah, this per this particular charger controller will do uh, 12 volts up to 20 amps. Um, so that kind of, if you know anything about electrical, that'll kind of give you a little bit of an idea of stuff that you can charge, laptop maybe, yeah. uh, with a power inverter, obviously. But, um, our yeah. thoughts are, you know, we could charge small stuff, our phones. We can charge our power inverter Mama, and Mama. use the inverter. So a cool thing about this charger is that uh, it has USB ports on it, and it also has little 12 volt plugs in it. So uh, you we can, can just plug right in. We can charge our ham in this. Yep. Mm -hmm. Ham radios and stuff. Okay, so right now we're just going to do a little test. So it is cloudy, you know, with direct sun, a solar panel will obviously work better. But a, a solar panel will work um, when it's cloudy as well, like a big solar panel like this. So uh, also this has an on-off button, so you can see where it says output off. So I push it and you can see the phone. So it. I'll turn it off. You'll see it turn off. I'll turn it on. And do it a little I slower. felt it. But, <laughs> yeah. So, well, turn it on. There's on. You can see the little. It's almost immediate. Yeah. On. But uh, yeah, so there. It's. Uh, so there. It's on and it's charging. <laughs> and uh, if there's not enough power from the sunlight, it'll keep charging off the batteries until the batteries are depleted. Right. So it's a whole. It's a whole ecosystem. But these two batteries um, should do pretty good. Um, you know charging a couple phones and maybe our ham radios and stuff so so this is this is uh this is really our first you know larger scale solar you've seen some of uh some of the solars that uh, we've shown in the past is the stuff that you know backpacking solars and camera. portable stuff and this is kind of the first step into something a little more permanent that we've done yeah, so we're thinking of putting the solar panel just outside and then, you know, keeping this inside um, and, you know, having it charge the batteries and having this a consistent uh, thing. Hi, <laughs> Kim Rob. Your yep, face is really just... dirty. <laughs> so we're, we're, we're pretty much kind of thinking that we're going to keep this thing set up and uh, possibly start adding more batteries to it so we can have just kind of a, a larger battery backup at the house. Yeah. So we're pretty happy with this. You know, even in cloudy weather, this solar panel's, you know, really nice and really doing good. Um, you know, and that's what solar panels should do. It should power even in cloudy weather. So pretty excited about this little project. 
So um, I'm going to put some links down below to where you guys can go check out some of the stuff that we have. You know, always do your research you know, on eBay and just the internet and stuff to get the best prices on everything. But I think that this is a really cool startup for us for, into like, you know, house. Uh, and there's an ice cream truck. <laughs> there's always something to interrupt. So we love solar and here in Texas, you know, that's a big advantage, but you know, like you know, keep repeating even in cloudy weather and even in places where it snows a lot, solar panels will work as long as there's no snow on it, obviously. <laughs> so just wanted to share that little project. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Conquer tomorrow by preparing today. Talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye.